this boat is a fast boat. We will be reducing travel time sometimes between six to eight hours. That is the game changer, the reality of the MB Malaysia. The carrying capacity, there are 10 containers, 10 by 10 containers that could be carried by this ship. It means that we could move greater volume and we'll be able to reduce the price for goods that are taken up to Region 1 for consumption. And it means also that the people of Region 1 could get back to farming in large scale because their products will be able to meet markets in Georgetown and beyond in record time without spoilage. That was one Edge Hill Ghana's Minister of Public Works speaking at a luncheon held on Friday to commemorate the arrival and commissioning of the country's new Northwest Ferry, the MV Malisha. The 70 meter long vessel was built in India under a 12.7 million US dollars grant line of credit from the government of India, and it is part of the modern sea going vessels Ghana now owns. An Edgel highlighted that Ghana's ports will undergo much needed expansion to accommodate these new vessels. We have also awarded the contract for the stelling at Port Kaituma. Work is progressing there nicely as well. We are just about ready to award the contracts for the stelling at Mabaruma. For the benefit of all, the vessel is much bigger than what the stelling at Mabaruma could accommodate. And where the stelling of Mabaruma is, because of the size of the vessel and how it has to work, it will almost be blocking the river if you go in that direction. So we are moving the stelling into a new location. The MV Malisha will soon be operational and Edgel said travelers will benefit from online bookings as well. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Fishani Ragbir.